Street Photography Secrets. One minute, one photo, one tip. Hi everyone, it's Sab here again on Street Photography Secrets Hints and Tips and today we're going to look at a dodgy door. Do you recognize this view? You probably do because uh, there's one of the most famous cathedrals in the world there. That's uh, Notre Dame and there's the uh, bon Pantheon, Pantheon in the distance. We're on a bridge of course and it's the uh, Pont Saint-Louis, Pont Saint-Louis Bridge. We're down here on this island here, just on the corner. Beautiful island, you should check it out. Okay, so we're on this little, uh, on this bridge here and we're looking at this corner because down on this corner, believe it or not, is the strangest thing, the strangest door. I often look over the edges of, of bridges uh, at the, the quayside because in Paris there's a lot of these walls and in these walls you often find strange things, I mean often and uh, one of the strange things I found was this. Okay, you see it's a, it's a door with a door number, <laughs> number 15 I think it is, and there ain't no door at all. It's all been boarded up, including nice little lines drawn along it, and it just makes me wonder why, you know, what was it, and, and who, on else you, who on earth used to live there? I've got a feeling someone did used to live there because I remember seeing someone living in there, um, a homeless person. Well, they had this home, but they obviously got kicked out, unfortunately. Um, so my tip for today is uh, look for dodgy doors. Do dodgy doors and uh, see what you can find. Um, but I wanted to do something different in this tip. I wanted to involve people more, and this might be the start of something, something new, something big. I wanted to show you uh, eight attempts that I made to get this photo looking okay and I'd like you to tell me which you prefer. Uh, this is actually possibly the first one I did which was cleaned up because the original would be incredibly mushy. So then I started playing around with one of those plastic camera apps as they call it. There's this, let's call this number two, this number three and this number four. So you see what's happening, uh, it's changing as we go along. Right, there's the original, there's number one with this red, uh, gloomy, very sort of gothic look, very deep shadows. This is blown out here, very white. Uh, the next one, number three, is... Uh, li I like the colours a lot. Um, I also like the fact that this... the contrast between the door frame and what has filled in the door is much greater than in number one here. You see it's pretty pale there, it doesn't have the same punchy effect, whereas number three is nice and punchy. But this is completely blown out. Uh, number four is better I think. It's it's not blown out so much and it's uh, it's still got a reasonable contrast here comparing to number one that's that's uh, the contrast is less. Okay right number five this is me just playing around with the special effects well effects <laughs> you decide if they're special uh, this is a dark sort of murky sepia there's a nice bright one let's call that number six Number seven, another sort of sepia one, but it's a different application, not that plastic uh, camera one. And there's the last one, a richer sepia than number, sorry, than number five. All right, that's number five. Number eight is a richer kind of sepia. So if you feel like telling me which you prefer, I think that would be very interesting. Uh, tell me on, well, you could leave a comment on the video page on YouTube, I guess, or on Facebook if you see it there. It's, it's all getting a bit complicated, isn't it, with all these things. I'll tell you what, wherever you see this, leave a comment if you feel like it. So, do you prefer number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, or number eight? And tell me why. Uh, in the comments. Okay, look forward to hearing from you. Don't forget my, my tip for today is uh, do some dodgy doors in your town. I'm sure there's lots of them if you look. Cheers, bye-bye, see you next time. Of your smiling face